What are we doing today? Uh, we're at the dentist. But we're not at the dentist yet because what do we have to do to get to the dentist? Yeah, use the elevator. Because Tayden gets to go in the elevator. Oh, dun, the dun, dun. I'm gonna fall down those and break my leg even better. <laughs> yeah, that's a serious staircase and I don't think we're gonna attempt it with crutches. Wait, is it number two? Let's take the elevator to number two. It is so snowy and icy and cold outside, but it's actually sunny today. But that usually means it's colder when there's not clouds after it snows. But everything is beautiful and sparkling like diamonds from the snow today. But we had to get up early and get the kids to the dentist this morning. So they're missing them in school to make sure those teeth are pearly white. Are you gonna hold the door for me, little gentleman? Thanks, buddy. Welcome. What were you so excited to see when we came in? What are they watching? Grumpy eyes. I can't hear you over there. Do you like coming to the dentist and watching the movie? Mm -hmm. William, how come you're at the dentist today? Because they're not gonna clean your teeth. You like to watch. Hi, guys. Okay, so I'm gonna have you come and put your head right here on this little pillow, okay? Do you like Zootopia? Yeah. Okay, I have cherry, vanilla, mint, or strawberry. Which one would you like? Mint. mint. Do you think you're gonna have any cavities today? Huh? Maybe what do you one. Think? Maybe one? How come you have one? Have you been eating too much sugar again? Don't touch me. That's, that's the magic tickler. No, Have you been eating too much sugar again? Is that why you have cavities? No, you're just mentally preparing yourself in case. Three candies a day. Whoa, that's way too much. William, do you like the dentist? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So William, when we came in, he's like, when is it going to be my turn? He just came to the dentist, if you guys don't remember, like a month ago and he had all that work done. And you would think that would be traumatic to him, but he loves the dentist. So he wanted to come this morning and see them and he's like, I want it to be my turn. What a good kid. Good job, buddy. Okay, you can close for a second, buddy. And open. Good job. Finally, your turn to watch the movie. Oh no, but it's over. They started it over, so. <laughs> she was trying to lay on the table or with Tatum just so she could watch the movie. One more blue raspberry. Vanilla. 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 Guess what, I've never had a kid try that one yet, so you'll have to tell me how you like it, okay? That's Dad's favorite. Is that why you picked it? Oh, oh that's sweet. <laughs> hey, cute girl, this is gonna go right here so I don't get anything on your. It does look like a penguin. Oh yeah, a that's polisher. what it is. It's a penguin head. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. So where'd you get her name from? It was actually a last name that okay. we had heard. Cool. And then we actually found out it's the name of an island in Southeast Asia. You have to go there, right? <laughs> and hey, my mom's from me. there, so oh, we cool. were like, that's really cool. That's awesome. Okay, babe, we're just gonna brush, okay? So what grade are you in, Tatum? Third. Third. Is it way fine? Yeah. Why? Are you going to go build a snowman today? Yeah. Yeah? Oh my gosh, what happened to that leg? <laughs> Does everybody ask you that? <laughs> that is one heck of a cast, dude. Oh, Seattle, awesome. <laughs> awesome. Just like that. Awesome. Right, open. Oh, sharing is caring. Okay, open up, William. <laughs> so, do you play any sports? Yeah, what do you play? Um, I 
What's one? What's your favorite? Soccer. Soccer. That's awesome. Okay, so we're gonna do the side ones first, and then we'll do the the front ones. Okay. So I'm gonna have you open up as big as you can, and then you're gonna bite on this for me. Okay. So this is gonna go right there next to your tongue, and you're gonna bite. Good job. This is gonna come right here, and I'm gonna go push a button really fast. Okay. Okay, guys. Who had cavities? Not me. Nikoi, did you have a cavity? Guess what? You don't have any new cavities. Good job, guys! Except so one of Nikoi's old fillings little... has gone bad, and so we're gonna have to come back in and they're gonna have to redo that one. It's a lip gloss. Do you want that one? Oh, that's so cute. Aw, even William got a balloon, and it's even your favorite color! Red! Did you have fun at the dentist? Yeah. Did you have fun at the dentist? Yeah. Okay, all aboard. Go ahead, all aboard. Okay, William. This is so scary. It's scary? This is scarier than, not scary than the stairs. Look, Mama. What did you get for a price? This rocket. That you rocket? You're gonna have a war because she got these little rockets that she can shoot and I can swing this at her. Oh yeah. Okay, the good news is that nobody had cavities. That's so exciting. That has been rare and far between visits at the dentist for us because with all these kids, we've had a lot of cavities. But the sad thing is that Nikoi had a bunch of dental work done when she was three, I think. And so they've just worn out. Just those fillings on baby teeth don't last very long. And so she has one that she has to have taken out. And he said it's bad enough that she'll have to have one of those silver crowns. And a root canal. Uh, so that really sucks. But we're happy that she's going to get it fixed and taken care of. And then the dentist said that Tayden is going to start losing tons of teeth again. He like lost all all these and then Number he said one. now it's time that like all the big ones in the back are gonna start Mom, all coming out this year is it gonna be like on that one week where I lost almost three teeth maybe I start lost popping two, those and then out got super wiggly the next week um it fell off and the dentist also said that probably in about six months it's time for Tayden to go and see the orthodontist so that they can make sure all of his teeth are coming in good and possibly talk about doing braces. Um, they do them really young now. I've seen lots of like eight-year-old kids walking around with braces because I guess if they get those first like eight in right, then usually the back ones come in right. Then you don't have to have them for like two years. They only put them on for you know six months to a year. So we've got to make an appointment to go and get that checked out. I don't want braces. Oh, you want crooked teeth? Okay, you can have crooked teeth. Hey, mister, did you get a balloon too? You're so lucky. Oh, but you look like the Red Hulk in there. <laughs> ah. Okay, back to school, kids. No. <laughs> What's up, Dykes fam? Hope you guys are doing fantastic today. So yes, it is snowing outside and we have a little bit of a Christmas bug here in our family right now because we're getting pretty excited about Christmas. Are you guys getting excited about Christmas? Let us know in the comments below. Are you guys getting pretty excited for Christmas? Yeah. Are you getting excited for Christmas? Yeah. That list wasn't enough. Oh no, you got a bigger list than that? Is Christmas about all the presents that you're going to get? Yeah. No. <laughs> Tayden, Tayden yeah. says yeah. It's about, no, it's about, no. it's about giving, not getting. Jeez, you Jeez, you bussy. Huh. You're a bussy boo boo. I, I love you. Uh, so we're just talking about <laughs> some gift ideas for, you know, some of our family members, like our parents and our, our grandma. Our parents are hard. I feel like... They're like us, and they have everything. Well, they if they want something, they go out and buy it. So. Yeah, so we need to think of something meaningful or something that we think that they need. Can Maybe we should get them a Lamborghini or something. That's something they don't have. <laughs> Your dad would love that. Yeah. So, anyways, I just had a question for you guys. What is something that you're looking forward to getting or giving this holiday season? And if you have any suggestions on what we should get maybe our kids mm -hmm. for Christmas, a Christmas present, 
let us know in the comments below. We would appreciate that because I think you guys could help us get some cool gifts for our kids. So Oh, yeah. They've been pretty good so far, but they can always end up on the naughty list <laughs> if they're not careful. So, you Nikoi especially. Are you on the good list or the naughty list? Naughty. Good list. <laughs> Oh, says, you're on the naughty list. No, right? she's on the naughty list. I'm if on you, the naughty If you list. argue, you both arguing right now means you're on the naughty list. I'm All right, who's been dreaming of a white Christmas? No, I no. haven't. <laughs> you haven't been dreaming of one? I haven't either. I have been. Oh, Dad. I'm dreaming <laughs> of a white Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know I was recording you. Yeah. Hmm. Do you think he can hear you? Try it again. Santa! Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas, William! <laughs> hey, are you excited for Christmas? Why? Because Santa brings presents. Because what? Look at me. Look at me. Santa brings presents. He does? But did you know he only brings presents to good little girls and boys? Have you been a good boy this year? Are you super excited? How excited are you? Super excited. Super excited? Please. You gotta say please. Please, Daniel. <laughs> Seriously, I'm getting so excited this year for Christmas. We have three kids, I mean, we have four technically, but three kids who are super duper excited for Santa Claus to come. And that makes me super duper excited. Are you super duper excited for Santa to come? Super duper excited. What is he going to bring me? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe a shaved faced husband. Hey, that's what I got last year. Oh, I guess one year is good enough, huh? One of my... Oh my gosh. Let's let's hear you yell as loud as you can, William. <laughs> William, what are you doing in here? Cleaning up. Cleaning up what? Mess. Your mess? Mm -hmm. What mess did you make? Um drawing on the on the kitchen. Drawing on the kitchen? So, Christina and I decided to lay down on the couch right there to take a little snooze while the kids were downstairs watching TV or coloring or whatever. We literally were for, uh, asleep for like 15 minutes. Get woke up and find out that William decided to draw in the kitchen and on the kitchen. Okay, show us where you drew on. So you drew on the, the floor. I don't know if you guys can really see that, but it's there. He drew all over the floor. There's an orange line over there. And then he decided to draw on the dishwasher. And then he decided to draw on the fridge. <laughs> What's that on the fridge that you drew? Monster. You drew a monster? That actually looks pretty good. That actually does look pretty good. But, William, where are we supposed to draw? On paper. On paper? Mm -hmm. And you knew that, huh? Mm hmm Okay, well, hey, clean it up. Mm. Are we supposed to draw on the floor? Uh -uh. Are you supposed to draw on the fridge? Uh-uh. Yeah, there you go, and I get the one by Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> His nose is Winnie the Pooh. I come over here and get the dishwasher cleaned off. It's what it is. Go, William. Blue sticks to white. Blue sticks to white, really good. Fortunately, there wasn't much damage and it was easily easy to clean up. But as a parent, you just want to yell at your kids and get mad at them for doing stuff like that. Even though Christina thought it was funny and she was laughing about it while she was trying to get mad at him. You guys, I have this problem where William is so darn cute and funny that I just can't get mad at him. Like, <laughs> I try so hard, but I'm like laughing inside because it's so hilarious. And he's like, he just... His face is so cute. Like, like he's unpunishable. Like, what? I didn't do it. Oh, where am I supposed to draw? Oh, paper. 
Like it's like he just doesn't even care. Like oblivious. But then, like, but then when he does say sorry, it like breaks your heart. He's I like, know. I'm sorry, mommy. Did you tell mommy you're sorry? Tell no, go tell her you're sorry for real. No, let go. Go tell mommy you're sorry for real. Sorry, mama. Okay, don't do that anymore, okay? That makes our house so dirty and just, messy and it ruins our stuff. Just, I turned draw a body on my paper. You couldn't draw a body on your paper because it was so big it had to be in the whole kitchen. <laughs> and he, he just, mom, he just had to write William all over. He's starting to really laugh and smile. Can you say hello?